USA, and then in 2010, I moved to Germany to be near him. And we got married last year. And then I found a job. I teach English to business people. So here I am today. Okay, will your answer is correct? Yes. Let's see together. Mustafa, yes. what about uh, 1982? Uh, she was born in 1982. Okay, great. What's next? She uh, After that... Uh, uh, 1995. 1995 went to live in USA. Great. They went to live in the... USA. Okay, in 2000, Mustafa? Uh, she became a school teacher. Yeah, she got a job as a school teacher. 2007, Shahsin? 2007, uh, she met her husband. Okay, and in 2010? She moved to Germany. She yeah. moved to Germany. Yeah, remember with the years we usually use in. In 1982, yes. in 1995, in 2000, yeah. in 2007, in 2010. Okay, here we yeah. have, yeah, you have a question, Sheikh Hussain? No, no, Dr. Barakanofik. Thank you. So uh, here we have four sentences. Please listen again and choose the correct answers. For example, number one. She was born in a small or a large town in Colombia. Yeah, so choose between small and large. Are you ready? Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Track 2.69. Okay, well, 1982 was a very important year for me. I was born in that year. I was born in a small town in the north of Colombia. My whole family lived there. My parents, my grandparents, uncles, aunts, cousins, everyone. It's a very nice place, very hot, tropical. I really loved it. And then 1995 was a very important year. Everything changed. My parents moved to the USA. My father got a job in Minnesota. So we went to live in the USA and I went to school there. I learned English quite quickly. In 2000, I got my first job. I was a school teacher. I taught small kids six to 10 years old. It was great. Then in 2007, I met Nico. He's my husband. He's German, but we met in the USA. And then in 2010, I moved to Germany to be near him. And we got married last year. And then I found a job. I teach English to business people. So here I am today. Okay, number one, Shah Hussein. Yes, she was born in a small town in Colombia. In Colombia, number two, Shah Hussein. She went to uh, USA with her parents. Yeah, she went to the USA with her parents. Yes. Okay, number yes. three and four, Mustafa. Uh, she taught young children. She taught young children, okay, number four. Uh, she went to Germany to be near Nico. Yes, okay, good. Good. Uh, so, by the yeah. way, yes. uh, teenage, teenagers. Teenager. Uh, teenagers. What is the meaning? Uh, yeah. saying you, can, you can divide this word into two main parts. You can divide the word teenagers into two mm. main parts. Ten and age, mm -hmm. teenagers, which means uh, people from age 13 up mm -hmm. to age 19 or 20. Mm -hmm. Okay? So okay. these are teenagers. Teenagers. Yeah. Okay, so sometimes you see teenagers. Teenagers. Uh, yes. Dr. Baha will come back. Can you hear me? Uh, doctor, in Arabic, uh, means uh, murahikin. Exactly, Mustafa. In Arabic, it's equal to murahikin, teenagers. Okay. We usually... Will... Yes, Dr. Baha, we'll come back. Thank you. So we say infant, Mustafa, we start with the baby. 
baby, B A B Y. After that, we say infant. I N F A N T. You can take notes. Baby, infant, child or kid, or sometimes you say toddler. Dr. Baha, can you hear me? Yes. Okay, good. So, uh, because you will help me with this, uh, I say that we start with the infant, I N F A N T. Oh, sorry, baby first. Baby, infant, toddler. What do you mean by toddler, uh, Dr. Baha? Toddler, uh, two to three years age. Yeah, you can see that a toddler is a young uh, infant or a young kid who learns to walk. A young children. Yes, a, a young, young child who who learns to walk. Yeah, after that we have the child. Sometimes we say kid. Then we have the teenagers. Uh, after that, we have adults or <coughs> elderly, which means old people. Okay? So okay. this is all about the age groups. Sometimes we say youth or young men. Okay, so here we go. Look at the timeline. Can you put the sentences A to F about George? Hmm. Who can, this is George, this is George's life. Can you make sentences about his life using these time lines? Okay. Hi, Dr. Baha, can you start? So, for example, let me help you with the first one. George was born in 1984. George was born in 1984. Okay, what about 1991? <laughs> He started uh, studying in uh, primary school. Okay, who, so he started primary school in 1995. Uh, he became a uh, uh, he, bec he became a teenager. Um, can we say he finished primary school or something like that? Um. Uh, the time is near to, to, to finish, is early to finish uh, primary school. Sometimes, uh, Mustafa, some, the... some countries, Mustafa, have only four years for primary cycle. Oh. Okay. Um, we consider it. Okay. Okay, so anyway, here we have uh, some, the timeline for George. I'll take a picture and I send it to you. I'll try again. Okay. No, it doesn't work. Anyway. Uh, yeah. Just wait, Dr. Hamada. Just wait. I will send it. Okay, Mustafa. I'll try to do it. Wait. Okay, thank you, Mustafa. There is another page. Okay, so this, this is the timeline for George. Can you match this timeline with the life events of George? Here is 
a list of the time the events. Okay, Dr. Baha, I got your message. So just please listen. And when you finish, you can uh, participate with us. No problem at all. Huh, you have three minutes. Try to match the sentences with the timeline or put them in the correct order. Doctor, yes, this uh, reading uh, related with the third point. Yeah, reading with George, this one. So I, I guess the, his journey from my mind, right? Right. No, no, no. It's related to George. This is George, and this is his life. Not from your mind, uh, Sheikh Hassan. From the next page, the next uh, paragraph, writing skills. Yeah, yeah, I know. But this this part is all, this one that I highlighted, it's all about exercise two. Okay. You got it? Okay. Okay. Uh, finished? Just wait, please. Take your time. Okay, I was going to get. Okay. I'm Mustafa finished. Finished, doctor. Yes, Mustafa, you can start. I was born in 1984 in Edinburgh, Scotland. Edinburgh, yeah, this is called Edinburgh, Mustafa. Edinburgh. Okay, so Edinburgh. this is the first live event. I was born in 1984 in Edinburgh, Scotland. Okay. Uh, number two, Shahsen. Okay. I was uh, 11. We moved to London and went to school. I uh, school there. there. I went to school there. Mm -hmm. Okay. Number three. Mm. Uh, I I don't see the answer. Okay, sorry. I in 
1998. What did he do in 1998? I, I understand this is uh, the place of year or what is the answer? We have the years, Sheikh Hussain, the years and the life events. We need to match them together. What is the answer in the, in the point? For number uh, two? I mm. think you finished number two. Number three, you mean? I left school. Left school at? I was 18. Okay, just wait. Just wait. I'll try to uh, find a good application for you. Wait. Ha Mustafa, what, what about your answers for this? Uh, I think uh, 2002, uh, I left school in 2002 and I get a job in band. Mm -hmm. uh, a year later, I went, to, I went to university in London and studied uh, engineering in 2003. Okay. Uh, uh, then uh, in uh, 2010, I got a job uh, as an engineer in South Africa. Okay. Uh, in South Africa, I met Carolina. We got and we got married uh, a few months later. Later. Okay, Sheikh Hassan, I'll later. try to later. share this with you. Can you see this screen now? This is the same exercise? I see, doctor, I see. Okay, number one. A. Number A. Sorry. Here are when all I answers. So, uh, A. A, it's suppose I, I choose from uh, C. One, two, three, yes, four. Yes, number five. one is done. I was born in 1984 in Edinburgh, Scotland. Number two, A. As Mustafa said, when I was 11, we moved to London and we went to school there. Number three, huh? I went to university. No, number three, F. Uh, no, no, uh, yeah, it's sub uh, I, I choose three from uh, the right side. Yes. So I went to university. It's supposed to I, I, I choose what uh, sentences from the right. Exactly. And mm -hmm. I, I highlighted it for you. Okay, is it easy now? Here, Sheikh Hussain, here we have, again, to make it easier for you, here we have the years. Okay? Okay, Sheikh Hussain? Here we have the years, and uh, here. Uh, okay. Doctor, we can pass. We can pass this exercise because the uh, screen is not full. You can see the screen well. Okay. Anyway, we can skip this exercise if you have a problem with the screen. Oh. I, I, was say? Focused, I, I was focused on uh, screen WhatsApp, but. <laughs> I miss uh, the screen of, of Zoom, so... Ah, <laughs> okay, okay, no problem. So here are the correct answers. Uh, can you read them again, please, Sheikh Hussain? Okay. Number one, I left... Uh, I left school. I left school. Number one... Number one is done, D. D. Um, I was born in 19... 
Edinburgh. Edinburgh, Scotland. Yes. Edinburgh, Scotland. Number two. Uh, number two, I left school. Number two, A. When I was. Number two. A. Letter A. Uh, doctor, I hope you understand. You can see the answers here? Yes. Huh? Can you see the answers? We have, uh, we have B, 1, 2, 3, and we have C, 1, 2, 3. Number 1, D. I was born in 1984 in Edinburgh, Scotland. Number 2, A. When I was 11, we moved to London and I went to school there. Number 3, F. I left school in 2002 and I got a job in a bank. Number 4, C. A year later, I went to university in London and studied engineering. Number five, E. In, then in 2010, I got a job as an engineer in South Africa. The last one is B. In South Africa, I met Carolina and we got married a few months later. Okay. Okay. Uh, now, try to complete the sentences. Exercise 3A. So, for example, hmm, in, how should I say, in 19, we're here. In 1995. Mm, we moved to London and I went to school there. Okay, number two. Number two. I was 11. We moved to London and I went to school there. Mm, can you complete? Mm. In 1998. Uh, no, we need only one word here. Only one word. We have a choice. We, we select from... Uh, okay. What? When? Where? What do you choose? Again, doctor? What? Where? When? 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 When mm. I was 11, we moved to London and we went to school there. Okay, exercise B, choose in or when. Yes. Exercise B, choose in or when. You have one minute. Okay, doctor. Okay, should I say number one? I left school when I was 18. When? Mustafa, number yes. two. Uh, in 2000, uh, in 2003, I went to school, uh, I went to university in uh, London. Okay, number three, should I say? Uh, when I was in South Africa, I worked as an engineer. Okay, good. Great, great. Now complete the sentences uh, with true information about yourself. So, for example, number one, I start school in 1990. Or I start school when I was five. It's about me. It's about me, Hamada. Okay? 
So write through sentences about yourself. So what are we going to do? Hello? Yes, doctor. Uh, uh, what doctor. are we going to do? Right? Uh, we will complete the sentence about ourselves. Yeah, exactly. Try to write through information, Mustafa. Okay. Okay, here is the screen. And here are... I sent you the sentences on the WhatsApp group so that you can follow and write about yourself. I uh, finished? Yes, doctor. Yes, okay, doctor. good. Yes, uh, Sheikh Hussain, uh, tell us about yourself. Mustafa, try to listen, and you can ask Sheikh Hussain any questions. But, uh, hold on, doctor. I first went on a plane. A plane. This is... Uh, yeah. Plane. I first a went plane. on a plane in 2013. A, a plane. A plane. What's the meaning? Uh, to travel by plane, Sheikh Hussain. A plane oh, is, um, yeah, exactly. It's a means of transportation when you travel mm. from one country to another country. Yes, yes, okay. Okay, okay. Yes, you can start. I started school when I was five years. Uh, I left, I left school. Uh, in uh, 27 you can see it's better to say 2007 I said 2000. from 2001 to mm -hmm. 2009 it's better to give 2001 mm -hmm. 2002 okay 2000, 2007 uh, 2006 2006 mm -hmm. I went to university in uh, 2007 I met my wife in uh, uh, 2019. Good, uh, very good. Yeah, I got my first job in uh, 2012. I first went uh, on a plane in 2023. I had my first phone, uh, I think, um, 
After how many years did you get your first phone, Sheikh Hussain? Again, doctor, please. After how many years did you get your first phone? After... For example, I had my first job in 2005. Three mm. years later, I had my first phone. After three years, I had my first phone. Yes. So, what about you? My phone before uh, before the job. Okay, so you get your you got your phone uh, after how many years after graduation after finishing university? Yeah, before I go to university. Okay, good, good. Okay, Mustafa. Uh, this is the end of uh, the Zoom session, so I'll send you the new link and we will start immediately. Please don't go anywhere.